first of all, um, I have to state, and this is not me, it is praising my own club. Mm -hmm. And I know that this has been compared to speaking to other disability access officers. I am fortunate, I work in the ticket office department. I have a very good relationship with the, the stand managers, the stewards, and the security officer um, and the ticket office staff. That's not always the case elsewhere, but it does allow me um, it, it does allow me to to give the best possible service possible, knowing I don't have to go and ask permission all, all the time. Um, obviously, for big things, I need to ask. But the other thing is, we're always looking at um, improvements. And as I said, we, we've got a few in the pipeline. I think I mentioned them earlier. Mm -hmm. um, we feel actually that of all the over the years, we've accomplished most things that we wanted to do. Um, we still want to improve the viewing areas and we would like to, as I mentioned, provide more support um, for spectators who are mainly children, but not always with autism. Um, uh, but um, you know, we, we, we feel we've, we've got there, but there's always little things that you can do to improve, always. Um, I'm, I'm thinking of realigning the wheelchair user seat so they have a, a different view and closer to families, little things like that. But I, I work part time because I'm obviously retired, but I work part time and, um, you know, you can only do so much. Mm -hmm. But one of the things is I, I get a, a quiet time and then thankfully hearts get to the cup semi-final and then, and this, you know, I'm involved in the semi-final ticketing, uh, which take, but at the same time, um, we, we feel that we, we want to offer all our disabled fans the opportunity to get the right tickets in the right places with their families at, at Hamden, rather than just join a queue and hope for the best. Well, with regard to other teams in the, in the Premiership, which is pretty constant, although you know teams do go up and down, I know all the, I know all the stadiums, haven't been to them all, and know where the best, the mo not the best, but where is accessible seating, mm -hmm. and where the wheelchair um, users go, and also car parking. So um, the as soon as we have an away fixture against any of the team, Hibernian Rangers, Celtic, Aberdeen, or whatever, we know which seats are accessible to keep for our fans. So for example, with mobility issues, and they know how to contact and get get these seats. So away games are not a problem, and although each of the away teams has different facilities, some better than others. Um, and and, and uh, for instance, we recently played Green at Morton, who have a very old stadium and a cup tie. Um, and they obviously didn't uh, weren't used to having as many away disabled supporters, so that was a challenge. But regarding at Hamden later today, I will be sent the manifest for the semi final, so I have all of the seating um, details, and I can reserve all the ones that I need for access and other ones for. For, for for family and then make, and then tie them in with the tickets. Not every other club does that. And some of the clubs are bigger. Rangers and Celtic, for instance, everything's balloted because they have so many supporters looking for tickets. And um, but we we try and make sure everybody's got a ticket that that need, needs one in the accessible areas. Um, so we're, we're well organised if it's games that happen. 